The Justice Party USA is a political party in the United States. It was organized in November 2011 by a group of political activists including former mayor of Salt Lake City Rocky Anderson as an alternative to what he saw as a duopoly of the two major political parties. One of the major goals of the Justice Party is removing corporate influence and other concentrated wealth from politics. History In December 2011, it became a qualified party in Mississippi, the first state to recognize the party. From a small beginning, 30 persons at the launching event with no TV crew covering it, the party was able to put its founder Rocky Anderson on the ballot in 15 states and secure official right in status in 15 additional states. It was the fifth largest third party in terms of presidential ballot access in the 2012 presidential election. On October 23, Anderson faced off with other third-party candidates Gary Johnson of the Libertarian Party, Jill Stein of the Green Party and Virgil Goode of the Constitution Party for a debate moderated by former CNN talk show host Larry King. They met again to debate on November 5, this time hosted by Ralph Nader. The party released a draft statement endorsing Bernie Sanders for the 2016 Democratic nomination rather than nominating its own candidate, but no official announcement was made. Ideology and positions The Justice Party was created with the motto, "...economic, environmental, and social justice for all." The party was designed with the intention of shifting government back to a focus on the Constitution by removing corporate influence in politics. Economic justice The Justice Party supports campaign finance reform and does not accept any corporate funding. The Justice Party supports a constitutional amendment to abolish corporate personhood through move to amend. The party is in favor of a financial transaction tax, pro-progressive tax structure and wants to end the Bush tax cuts. They support green jobs and infrastructure programs. The Justice Party wants to bolster social security by raising the cap on payroll taxes. It wants to require that banks work with homeowners to stop foreclosures. It is pro-immigration reform, pro-breaking up large banks, pro-reinstating Glass-Steagall, pro-government-funded higher education and against subsidies to oil and gas companies. Environmental justice The party is for aggressive climate protection. It is against the Keystone Pipeline and advocates transition from fossil fuels to renewable energy. The Justice Party supports a ban on mountaintop removal and wants to strengthen the Environmental Protection Agency. <laughs> <laughs> Social justice The Justice Party supports a universal single-payer health system, an equal rights amendment for women, marriage equality, ending wars of aggression, closing many military bases, reducing the budget, immigration reform, repealing the Patriot Act, protecting and rewarding whistleblowers and ending the war on drugs. The party also seeks to prosecute individuals whose illegal conduct led to the 2008 financial crisis. Candidates In the 2012 elections, the party had candidates for the following offices President of the United States, Rocky Anderson, former mayor of Salt Lake City 43,088 votes 0.03% Vice President of the United States, Luis J. Rodriguez, activist and author from California Senator for Utah, Daniel Geary 7,444 votes 0.81% Utah's 4th Congressional District, Torin Nelson withdrew. See also John B. Anderson <laughs>